We have a bear paint color to talk about that was requested by one of my beautiful Patreon members. Thank you all for your support. It is called Blue Metal by Bear Paint. And because I wasn't familiar with it offhand, I heard the name and I thought, okay, this is probably a light, cool, grayish color. But then I loaded it up on the website and boom. I mean, you can probably see right here, this square, that's blue metal. It is a beautiful, almost charcoal teal color. A little bit of blue, a little bit of green. We're gonna talk all about it. And more importantly, in this episode of Color Quickie, I'm gonna give you my color pairings for it. So if you're interested in blue metal or colors of this nature and you want other colors to go with it, I'm the color guy here to give you all the suggestions in the world. Well, at least five of them. The thing I wanna start off with is this description on the Bear website. Strong and dark, blue metal is a smoky charcoal running deep with blue undertones. Its complexity resonates like a rock and roll anthem. Bam! <laughs> I mean, it is called blue metal after all. <laughs> That's fun. Now, if you've been paying attention to design trends moving into 2024, blue is making a comeback, but not necessarily these sort of somewhat green leaning blues. And not to say that this is a green by any means or even a teal, but it has just a touch of it that pulls it away from being purple. If I were to distill this color into a description, it is a slight gray with a very, very heavy blue undertone. Sometimes blues can go a little more purple, which we have seen in some of the colors of the year, but this one goes the opposite direction where it goes just a bit towards green ever so slightly. In terms of the LRV, the light reflectance value, this color reflects only 12% of the light that hits it, and that makes it a very dark color. It is quite deep, very saturated, pretty heavy, so this is not a color to use in an area that you want to feel light and airy, unless you're using it in small doses, like an accent wall, for example. All right, so let's talk about some color pairings. If your primary color is going to be blue metal and you're thinking of some baseboard color options, I got two choices for you. If you wanted light trim, go with white. Bear Paint's classic white. It isn't their brightest color. It has an 83 LRV, but that still is light enough to have a huge amount of contrast with blue metal. White trim is just classic. It's your standard kind of go-to color. A darker trim option that I might recommend for you if you didn't want white is Meteor Shower. And this is actually a mid-tone color, but it has a lot of similarities to Blue Metal in terms of its undertones. Again, that sort of blue, greenish leaning gray. And this one has enough contrast as well with Blue Metal, but it's not white. So a little more of a subtle transition going from your walls to your trim. And then of course the bonus option is to have blue metal on your trim too. Just make sure you're using trim paint on your trim, please. Okay, so trim and baseboards, done. What about other wall colors or room colors you can use that go with blue metal in really fun ways? The first one is silver ash. And this is kind of a lighter color that is a neutral, but it is a very soft toned down sage green that feels very muted. So it's a subtle coloration, but to me its strongest undertone that's visible is that bit of green, which ties into the hint of green that's in blue metal. It is a bit warmer than the main color we're talking about in blue metal, not quite as warm as a cream or a beige. So still within that sleek contemporary cool feel. And if you're starting with a color like blue metal, then I'm assuming you like cool colors, which is why my second choice is offshore mist. So this is another color that is kind of in that light category that has a 66 LRV, so just a slight bit more saturated than the previous color. And this one is very blue dominant. And I would say that the green is actually toned down quite a bit more compared to blue metal. It just has a light sky blue feeling to it. So within that blue family, this is a more uplifting blue that is going to feel more buoyant, airy, fun, light, but still has a clear saturation. So it won't feel washed out if you have a very well lit environment that can maybe make other light pastel blues kind of look boring. This one should hold its color in a lot of circumstances, which I think is interesting. It does have that slight bit of warmth to it. So it does feel vibrant, but it doesn't take it into greeny turquoise territory either. It's just kind of a perfect balance. And then for our third color pairing, this is probably the accent color. Blue metal is kind of an accent in its own right, but this color, although not as dark, is a lot more punchy. It's called Semi Precious. And this is very much your classic vibrant jewel tone kind of teal. So while blue metal is that kind of grayed out blue with that touch of green, this one is just a deep emerald green with that little bit of blue to sort of pull it towards teal 
kind of that turquoise aquamarine territory. And it is extremely saturated fun, but it has a 29 LRV, so it reflects more light than you might think. It is definitely gonna stand out no matter what space you use it in. Here's the color palette all together. Let me know what you think of this blue themed color scheme. And we have another video about a really cool blue right over here.